EA Sports. It's in the game. EA Sports. If it's in the game, it's in the game. NCAA Football 2003. South Bend, Indiana and Notre Dame Stadium is the site for this one. And it's going to be a hot one out here for today's game between the Florida State Seminoles and the Fighting Irish of Notre Dame. And here comes the Fighting Irish. Buddy Brad Nessler, Lee Corso, and Kirk Herbstreet here ready and excited to bring you what appears to be another great gridiron matchup. The Fighting Irish are looking for an upset in this one, but Kirk, I just don't see that happening. Uh, there's no question about it. This one's going to be pretty ugly. Florida State is going to dominate this football game, and they're going to do it with the running back. I mean, this guy is unstoppable. I expect a huge game for him in this game, Lee. I'm talking about 200 yards and three touchdowns at least. Kirk, I agree with you 100%. Florida State has a huge advantage in one particular area, the running game. Kirk, look for them to run the ball 40 to 50 times in this game and absolutely demolish and demoralize this defense. Big win in this one. Thanks, guys. Looks like we're going to have an action-packed game. So let's get down to the field where they're waiting for the coin toss. Notre Dame lines up to kick this one off, and we're just about set to get underway. Kicks it off. Number one fields it in the end zone. They'll go to work at the 21-yard line. Notre Dame comes out in the 3-4. Play action. He goes downtown. And it's caught. How about that catch? Yeah, he caught that ball like an athlete. I love this guy. Kirk, can you break this one down for us? Yeah, Brad, this one's real simple. You'll see the quarterback make a nice fake to the back. This causes the defense to step up a little bit, which in turn leads to an open wide receiver downfield. It's first and ten. Ball on the 46. Three-man front defensively. He drops back. Steps up in the pocket. He throws it. Complete. A nice completion to the tight end. A good play here. And the thing that I notice is that he provides a nice big target out there for the quarterback. Second and two. Ball on the 38-yard line. Number 16 comes to the line. Three wide. Spins up field. And down he goes at the 31. And a nice run by the tailback. Not a lot of razzle-dazzle here, but it gets the job done and picks up the first down. First and 10. Ball on the 31-yard line. The Fighting Irish line up in a 4-3. Little shake and bake move. They'll bring him down at the 29-yard line. The halfback gets a couple there on the counter. Second and eight coming up here. Fifth play of this drive coming up. Florida State comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Number 20 tackles him for a loss on the play. And the defense was ready for that play. Boy, you better believe it. That play didn't have a chance. It's 
third down and nine to go. Ball on the 30-yard line. Number 16 with three wide receivers. Back to pass. Looks. He passes it. And he's tackled at the 21-yard line. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah, nice little pitch and catch there. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense. And the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. First and ten. Seventh play of this drive coming up. Florida State comes out with an eye formation. Number 16 crosses to the left side. Number 81 brings him down for a loss. Kirk, they really had nothing going on that run. I'll tell you what, Brad, it's almost like he ran into a brick wall on that play. Second and long. This is the eighth play of this drive. The Seminole line up in an eye formation. Number 16 drops back. He unloads it. And it's caught. And they make the stop at the 26-yard line. Back to the line. Maybe a yard on the pass. It's third down and 15 to go. Ball on the 26-yard line. They'll bring in their dime package. Drops back to pass. He's looking. He's the long one down the middle. It falls incomplete. They got some good pressure on him there. Yeah, but don't forget the fact that nobody was open. That was good coverage, too. Fourth and 15 coming up. They're in field goal range. Number 47 lined up for the field goal, and he's going to need some distance on this one. The kick is up, and it sails through the upright. And he's got to be happy about that kick. Oh, no question. This kid is a solid kicker. Florida State to kick. He hits a booming kick. Number 34 fields it in the end zone. Get the ball here at the 20-yard line. Florida State going with a three-man front. Number seven pitches out to the right. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Well, the offensive line needs to do a better job up front of opening the hole for the running back. It's second down and 11 to go. Ball on their own 19. The Seminole use a four-man front here. Hunt. 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 On the ground, up the middle. Number 58 with a takedown at the 20-yard line. The fullback back to the original line of scrimmage, and that's it. Third and 10, ball on the 20-yard line. They come out in a nickel. He drops back. Let's it fly. Bat it away. That brings up the punting situation. I'll tell you what, this defense did a heck of a job that time to hold them to three and out. Fourth and ten coming up. Ball on the 20-yard line. The Fighting Irish are lining up to punt it away. Number 20 calls for the fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 44-yard line.
They'll start this drive at the 44-yard line. Defense lines up in a 3-4. Number 16, back to pass, looking. This one's thrown deep over the middle. Complete. Number 56 brings him down at the 37. He's going to come out. It looks like he was hurt on that last play. Ah, uh, rub some dirt on it, kid. Get back in the game where you belong. We are ready to start quarter number two. First and ten. Ball on the 37-yard line. The Fighting Irish line up in a nickel back. Number 16 drops to throw. He's looking for his man. Number one has it, and he's taken down at the 26. Good job on the pass there. Yeah, let me tell you something. These passes are exactly what they need to put pressure on that defense. It's first and 10, ball on the 26-yard line. Notre Dame lines up defensively in a 4-3. Number 16 gives it up the middle. Number 34 with a takedown at the 23-yard line. Three yards there on the delayed handoff. Second and seven coming up here. Ball on the 23. The Seminole come out in a shotgun. Back to pass. Throws it out there, and it's caught. Can't wrap him up. And he's tackled at the 23-yard line. Nothing gained on the play. Third and seven coming up here. This is the fifth play of this drive. Notre Dame lines up in a dime defense here. Complete. What an incredible diving catch. I'll say catches like that are sure to make the highlights. First and ten. They're inside the 20. They line up in an eye. Drop back to pass. Let's it go. It's caught for the touchdown. And the wideout hauled it in for the score. Boy, the quarterback really put that one on the money, didn't he? Let's take a look at that pass again, guys. You know, this defense might want to think twice about calling another blitz like that. The quarterback recognizes it right away and just picks apart the secondary. And he tacks on the extra point. Over three minutes remain in the second quarter, and the score is Florida State 10, Notre Dame nothing. Florida State to kick this one off. Kicks it off. Number 34 fields it in the end zone. He spins around. They'll take over at the 22. Florida State brings in their nickel package. He drops back. He fires left side. Number six hangs on to it. He didn't have much of a chance on that play. Boy, this defense has a lot of speed. They're all over him by the time he caught the ball. It's second down and eight. Ball on their own 24. Florida State lines up defensively in a 4-3. He's out to the 30. 
Number 58 brings him down at the 34-yard line. A monster run there by the fullback. <laughs> You're right, Brad. That was a scary run for this defense. Coach, scary or not, you got to wrap the big guy up. You can't allow the fullback to run wild like that on your defense. First and 10, ball on their own 34. Florida State comes out at a 4-3. Number 22 takes a pitch. He spins. And they make the stop at the 45. Nice pickup on that run. Here's a perfect example of running the toss play. Good pitch, good catch, and blocking was good enough up front to spring this tailback to a monster game. It's first and 10. Ball on the 45-yard line. They come out with three wide receivers. Number seven drops back to pass. He lets it go, and it's caught. Tackle at the 44-yard line. So they pick up quite a few yards on that play, Kirk. Well, that was an excellent route, and he did a great job of holding on to the football. First and ten. Fifth play of this drive coming up. Number seven has four receivers lined up here. He throws it. And it's incomplete. Boy, would he like to have that one back. Yeah, you're right. This offense relies so much on timing. And as you saw there, when their timing gets knocked off, they have a tough time connecting on plays like this. Second and 10, ball on the 44. The Fighting Irish line up with two tight ends. Number seven gives it up the middle. Number 41 with a takedown at the 28-yard line. Great run by the tailback. On that play, the defense looked a little overmatched there. They just got swallowed up at the line of scrimmage. I gotta see that one again. First and ten, ball on the 28-yard line. The Seminoles come out in a 34 defense. Number nine brings him down at the 23-yard line. The Fighting Irish are going to take a timeout, and they'll have two remaining. Second and five coming up here. Ball on the 23-yard line. Notre Dame sets up in the eye. They run a counter. Number 42 with a takedown at the 20-yard line. So the old counter gets two, maybe three yards. It's third down and two to go. Ninth play of this drive coming up. Notre Dame will line up in a jumbo set here. A little juke. They'll bring him down at the 13. The offense calls a timeout, and they'll have one timeout left. It's first and ten. They're in the red zone. Defense lines up in a 4-3. Number seven gives it up the middle. He's hit and got away. Oh, he got nailed on that one. They pick up a good six yards there. Guys, when we were at practice this week, you kind of got the feeling that they might run a little no huddle. In fact, here it comes. Number seven, back to throw. Tipped away. The defense needed that one. How about the move here by this cornerback? Great play that time, getting a hand on the football. The Fighting Irish line up in a split back set. Number 42 brings him down at the four. The fullback picks up about three yards on that carry.
Number 13, lined up for the field goal. This should be a chip shot. It's up, and it's right down the middle. Notre Dame, ready to kick this one off. Kicks it deep. Number 20, fields it in the end zone. There's a flag on the play. Clipping, Clipping. on the receiving, on the receiving team. team. After this to the spot, first down. First down. They'll go to work at the 10-yard line. They line up in the jumbo set. Number 16 gives it up the middle. He's to the 20. Number 19 with a takedown at the 22. And we've reached halftime here. The score at the break. Florida State 10, Notre Dame 3. Florida State will be kicking off to start the second half. He kicks it. Number 34 takes it at the four. get the ball here at the 22-yard line. The Seminoles line up at a 3-4. Number 58 brings him down at the 24-yard line. Two-yard pickup. It's second down and eight to go. Ball on the 24. Notre Dame goes with the ace set here. He's out to the 30, to the 40, spin move. Number 58 with a takedown at the 46-yard line. Nice game for the halfback. That time they kept it on the ground with the counter play. The blocking was great up front. The tailback was able to get into the open field and do some special things. It's first and ten, ball on the 46-yard line. Florida State lines up defensively in a 4-3. Number 22 takes a handoff. Number 58 brings him down at the 47-yard line. And he gets a yard on the run. Second down and nine to go. Ball right around midfield. The Fighting Irish line up in an I formation. They hand it off. Jed's a tackler. Number 90 with a takedown at the 47. A gain of six. We get third and three here. This is the fifth play of this drive. High formation here. Number seven, on play action. He passes it, and it falls incomplete. What happened there, Kirk? Well, as a quarterback, you usually want to put the ball in front of the receiver so he can catch it in stride. Here he just put it a little bit too far in front. Fourth and three coming up. Ball on the 47. They line up to punt this one away. Number 20 signals for a fair catch.
They'll start this drive at the seven yard line. The Fighting Irish put four men up front. Number 16 hands off on the delay. Number 50 brings him down at the 10. The back gets three on the carry. Second and seven, ball on their own 10. They'll bring in their dime package. Number 16 drops back, looks. He wants it all going long. And that one's fallen incomplete. The wide receiver couldn't quite hang on to that. They're down in seven, ball on the 10. Number six, lines up as a single back. Back to pass, under heavy pressure. He unloads it, and it's incomplete. So they go three and out after that incompletion. Fourth and seven, ball on their own 10. It's fourth down, and the punt team lines up. Number 22 calls for the fair catch. He hauls it in at the 48-yard line. They'll take over at the 48. They use four linebackers. Set. Put hot. Hot. He's in trouble. Let's it fly. Incomplete. The pass, the pass falls, falls incomplete. incomplete. Number, Number 14, 14, the intended, intended receiver, receiver on the play. play. So it's second and 10. Ball on the 48 yard line. Number seven with three wide receivers. Set. Put hot. Hot. And they make the stop at the 49-yard line. That's a three-yard pickup. It's third down and seven to go. Ball right around midfield. Florida State comes out defensively Hunt. with six defensive backs. Hunt. 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 Here's the option left. Elateral. Number 10 with a takedown at the 39-yard line. A nice third down conversion there. Guys, this offense has a tendency to run the football in this situation, as you can see, with good reason. Or any situation for that matter. If I'm the coach, I'm going to run the option play over and over again until they prove to me that they can stop it. It's first and 10, ball on the 39-yard line. Number 22, alone in the backfield. He drops back. He's looking. He's looking for his man. Complete. Not a bad play there. Not at all. If this wideout can continue to make plays like this, allowing them to spread the ball around. This offense is going to be tough to stop. First and ten. Fifth play of this drive coming up. They line up with split backs. Number seven gives it up the middle. Brought down at the 16-yard line. They get about five yards from the halfback. It's second down and five to go. This is the sixth play of this drive. The defense will stack the line of scrimmage. Hunt. 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 Number seven, back to pass. 
Throws it out there, and it falls incomplete. Couldn't find his man in the end zone there. You know, as a quarterback, I can tell you that the defense is always tougher down in the end zone. Third and five. Seventh play of this drive coming up. Number 22 lines up as a single back. Hunt! 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 Number seven makes a handoff. Let's it go. Incomplete pass. Well, he tried to thread the needle with that pass. Well, here the quarterback makes a poor decision throwing into coverage. He needs to look at his progression and find the second and third receiver. Fourth and five coming up here. Ball on the 16-yard line. They'll call on the field goal unit here. The kick is up. And he got it. Notre Dame to kick this one off. Kicks it off. Number one takes it at the four. And that's the end of the third quarter. Our score in this one, Florida State 10, Notre Dame 6. They've switched sides and these teams are all set to start the fourth and final quarter. They'll go to work at the 25 yard line. High formation here. Number 34 brings him down at the 30. He rumbles ahead and picks up about five. Second down and five to go. Ball on the 30-yard line. Notre Dame going with a three-man front. On the ground, up the middle. Number 20 with a takedown at the 39-yard line. That's a good nine-yard gain. First and ten. Ball on their own 39. Number six. Alone in the backfield. Number six on the give. Tries to shoot. And he's tackled at the 49-yard line. A 10-yard gain. Second down and short. Ball on the 49. Number 16 comes to the line with three wide. Number 56 brings him down for a loss. Looks to have been shaken up a bit on that play. Hey, that kid went down hard, but he's a tough kid. He'll shrug it off. It's third down and seven to go. Ball on their own 42. The Seminoles go with the eye formation. They'll run the option. Juke move. He's to the 50. Number 20 brings him down at the 42-yard line. What an outstanding third down conversion. Yeah, and he showed pretty good quickness there, picking up a nice game. Good quickness and very good decision making. Not a whole lot going on as far as throwing the ball there. He makes a wonderful decision, bringing it down and making a big play. Notre Dame lines up with five defensive backs. The option left. Breaks one. Number 19 with a takedown at the 33-yard line. And they pick up nine there. Second and one coming up here. Ball on the 33. 
The Fighting Irish bring in the nickel package. Drops back to pass. He lets it go, and down he goes at the 26-yard line. How do you like that pass, Lee? I don't know about the pass, but the result, a first down, ha, that's what I like. It's first and ten. This is the eighth play of this drive. Florida State sets up in the eye. Back to pass. He throws it. And it's caught. And he's taken down at the 20-yard line. The Fighting Irish call for a timeout. And that was their first timeout. Second and four coming up here. Ninth play of this drive coming up. Number six is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Handoff up the middle. The 10, the 5. Touchdown, Seminole. What was the secret to that touchdown, Coach? Hustle, hustle, and more hustle. The running back never gave up on that play, and that's why he got in there. And he tacks on the extra point. So with less than two to go in the fourth quarter, the score is Florida State 17, Notre Dame 6. Florida State, the kick. Nice kick, plenty of distance. Number 34, fields it in the end zone. They'll get the ball here at the 25-yard line. Defense lines up in a 3-4. Put hot! Put hot! Number seven drops to throw. Looking, guns it across the middle. Off his hands, incomplete. That looked like a pretty good pass. Yeah, it was, and it was a catchable ball. Thrown right at him. He just didn't catch it. It's second down and ten to go. Ball on their own 25. Number 22 lines up as a single back. Dead ball. Dead ball. Won't start, Won't start on, the on the offense. Five yard penalty. Still, 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 still second down. down. Second down, and they got 15 for the first down. Ball on the 20-yard line. He drops back. Steps up. He passes it. Incomplete. Underthrown intended for the halfback. It's third down and 15 to go. Ball on the 20. Notre Dame goes with the ace set here. Set. Put hot. Put. Put hot. Put hot. Drop back to pass. Here comes the pressure. Number 48 comes away with a sack. And coach, I'm really surprised about the play call there. Oh, no question, Brad. It's third and long. You're losing in the fourth quarter. You got to throw the football. Number seven, back to throw. He unloads it. Flag down, brought down at the 28-yard line. Personal, Personal foul. foul. Face, Face mask, mask on the defense. On the defense. 15, 15 yards. yards. And it's
It's first and ten, ball on the 43-yard line. The Fighting Irish come out showing three wide. Back to pass. He guns it to the left. Number three with a catch. Notre Dame takes a timeout. That was their second timeout. First and ten. This is the sixth play of this drive. The Fighting Irish line up in an I formation. Number seven steps back to pass. Let's it fly. Complete. Number 41 brings him down at the 32-yard line. And they get the first down on that completion, Coach. That was a very nice first down conversion. The key to that play was the fact that the quarterback had plenty of time to look downfield. Number seven drops back to pass. He faked the spike. He's going to try and throw it. And they couldn't hook up on that one. So it's second and ten. This is the eighth play of this drive. Florida State comes out in a 3-4. Number seven, back to pass. Rifles it right side. Number 18 makes a catch. And down he goes at the 13. The wide receiver picks up good yardage that time. Number seven drops back. Fakes the spike, looking to throw it. And he can't make the catch. I think he heard footsteps that time, guys. He must have heard something, because he just flat out dropped that ball. Second and ten. This is the tenth play of this drive. The Fighting Irish go with the I formation. Number seven, back to throw. He's looking for his man. Couldn't haul it in. Incomplete pass. Number 14, the intended receiver on the play. Third down and ten coming up. Eleventh play of this drive coming up. They'll bring in their dime package. Hut, hut. Hut, hut. Hut, hut. Number seven steps back to pass. Looks. He rifles it to the left. He's got it. Touchdown. Coach, how about that play? Yo, was that a sensational pass or what? Covered by the offense. They need to get the ball back right here if they want to stand a chance with the onside kick. So that onside might have been their last chance. Well, you can't blame these guys for trying, but you never know. The other team could make a mistake. They'll start this drive at the 31. The Fighting Irish come out in a 4-3. Notre Dame. Calls a timeout, and that was their third and final timeout. Second and 12 coming up here, all on their own 29. Three-man front defensively.
And that's pretty much going to do it. Kirk, what would you think of this one? Well, more than anything else, I'm disappointed for the players. Notre Dame walks away from this game utterly disappointed because they nearly pulled off one of the biggest upsets in school history. But you know what? I think after the initial hurt wears off, these guys will be proud of the way they played today. Folks, thanks for tuning into this game. Our final score, Florida State 17, Notre Dame 12. For Lee Corso, Kirk Herbstreet, and everyone at EA Sports, I'm Brad Nessler saying goodbye and see you next time.